Hello, can you hear me? Hello, teacher. Hi. Hello, Anna. Hi, Jenny. How are you? Hi. Good evening. Hi. Good Thank evening. You. How's your day today? I was very tired. <laughs> Why? <laughs> um, um, se lo voy a decir en español. Yo salgo a, a campo, a, en territorios, a diferentes en municipios. Ok. Entonces, oh, me, me imagino. Sí. Okay, let me see, let me check, let me check, let me open this. So we have my day, welcome my day. Welcome back, what happened to you, my dad? Hello teacher, I, I'm working <laughs> in, okay. in this moment. Tomaron vacaciones del gobierno. No, estoy trabajando. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. Okay, so now we have Sobeida, Maite, we have Maritza, Jenny, Anna Maria. Okay, one more second. Okay, let's start. Do you remember what we did yesterday? Yes, teacher. What did we do yesterday? What did we practice? Um, use a so to ne neither in either. Mm -hmm. um, I remember and use the so and to says um, for example, but you ask me the question is the, I, I like, I like pupusas and the answer say me too. Yes. But remember, we also did, um, the difference between a verb and an adjective. Yeah. When we say I am, we use an adjective. When we say I with no auxiliary, we use a verb, right? Yeah. Okay. Hello, Catherine. Hello, Karen. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, Catherine. Good evening. Hi, Sobeida. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. And you? I'm fine, teacher. What time did you stop working today? At, at 6 p.m. because I went to my house because my nephew, my brother, and me, I was the exercise. exercise. You did exercise? Yes, I did exercise. Where? In the park, ex casa presidencial. Oh, okay, good. Hey, that park is boring. Yes. It, I... o sea, it looks nice. It looks nice. One time, one time I went with my wife and my son, Eva Mojai, but <laughs> there's nothing. <laughs> no hay nada. En las tardes ponen como cositas para niños que yeah. para saltar y eso. 
Pero sí, yo pienso que es muy para ejercicio. Uh -huh. Or bicycle. Ajá. Ya. Yeah. Y uno puede entrar al zapote. ¿Por qué, teacher? No, uno puede entrar. Ah, sí, pero paga cinco dólares por el año. Y le dan un carnet. Por el año. Por el año. Five dollars. Sí. Oh, that's good. Yes. But it's boring, too. It's boring. <laughs> it's boring, too. Yeah. Yeah, I imagine it's boring. Ah. Yes. Okay, so, do, 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 everybody. Okay. Dum, 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 dum. Let me see. Do you see my screen? No, teacher. No, wait, I turned it off. Hold on. Give me one second. Okay, do you see my screen now? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, good. Okay, let's do this like this. Nah, I'm gonna see. Do, do is the auxiliary for what? I. Mm -hmm. You. We and they, right? Yeah. Yes, yes. Mm. Let's compliment. Teacher, yo no puedo ver su pantalla. ¿Quién más no puede ver mi pantalla? ¿Quién más? Only who? ¿Quién no la puede ver? Ok. Yo, teacher. Who? I'm sorry, ¿quién no la puede ver? Yo, 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 yo. yo. Ana. Oh, Karen, Karen. Yes. Karen, pero usted la única que no lo puede ver está de un celular. Sí, eso es correcto, dicho. Maybe, maybe it's the application. Yo, perdón, yo la, yo estoy desde el cel y si la puedo ver. Yo también. Ya, porque... Karen, mueva su, su pantalla, mueva su pantalla o hacia la izquierda o derecha 
y va a tener que ver, va a tener que vernos o ver la pantalla. Vaya moviéndola y va a encontrar la, la pantalla del profesor. Si no, tírala contra la pared. Yo creo bueno. no. el, el, el teacher le va a regalar uno nuevo el teacher, ah, vaya, por favor del último modelo de Samsung por favor no, no me funciona I don't know but I definitely is your telephone ah, permítame ya sé que voy a hacer me voy a salir y voy a volver a ingresar. A ver. Yeah, okay, maybe. Okay, so listen, do this is to make a question. Oh. Do you like broccoli? Uh, Catherine, do you like broccoli? Yes, I do. Very good. Yes, I do. Oh. No, I, I don't. don't. I like. Uh -huh. Yes, I do or no, I don't. So, pero miren cómo es, do you like broccoli? Yes, I do, or yes, I like it, or yes, I like broccoli. Mm -hmm. But you mm -hmm. can't say, mm -hmm. yes, I like. Mm -hmm. Okay. Karen Sandoval. Yes, teacher. Karen, do you have a boyfriend? Este, qué pregunta tan difícil. It's complicated. <laughs> so much, so much complicated. <laughs> sometimes I do. You can say sometimes I do. Mm. No, teacher. No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay. Le pregunto si, you, do you have a boyfriend? Porque creo que Jenny is the only married woman in this classroom. No, I am married to... Oh, Arely, you're back. <laughs> I'm sorry. You're back. Welcome. Wow, Arely. I... <laughs> what happened to you? No. Oh, it's okay. complicated to explain, but I'm here. <laughs> okay, good. <Thanks> okay. <laughs> Welcome back. So listen, yesterday we practiced a do you and are you, remember? Class? Okay, I know that Anna, Jenny, Karen, and Catherine were in class yesterday. Do you remember? Yes, it mm -hmm. Oh, and Sobeida too. Thank you. Okay, today remember we're going to learn about have you. Okay, here is, I lived in San Salvador for 15 years. And here is, I have lived in San Salvador for 15 years. What is the difference? Is the verb? Okay, the verb is different, yes. Have. Uh, and no, a person no, that uses a, Use an auxiliary hub. Okay, good. 
Hoy sí se lo puedo decir en español. Si yo digo, yo viví en San Salvador 15 años y yo he vivido en San Salvador por 15 años, ¿qué es la diferencia? Que uno hace relación a que todavía está viviendo en San Salvador. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So listen. This. I lived. I lived in San Salvador for 15 years. The action started and finished. No more. Past. Arely, where do you live now? In San Salvador. I live in San Salvador. Where? In Colonia Dreyfus. Oh yeah, Dreyfus. Okay. I remember. Yeah, weird. <laughs> yeah, I, I um, really, I never heard of that. <laughs> yeah. Um, it's close to Montserrat and Colonia Iwan, something like that. Okay, yeah. All your life in Dreyfus? No. No, but... Before Dreyfus? Before Dreyfus in Colonia 3 de Mayo. Close to Dreyfus. Okay, so how long did you live in Colonia 3 de Mayo? How, how long? Uh, from, no. I think that eight years ago. No, but ¿cuánto tiempo vivió ahí? Just... Three years. Three years, okay. So I lived in Colonia Tres de Mayo three years. Yeah, okay. No more. And in Dreyfus? Uh, five, five years. So I have lived in, in Colonia Dreyfus for five years. Entonces empezó en el 2017, ¿no? Yes. So, the action started in the past. Correct? The action started in the past, but it continues to now. This is present continuous. Present perfect. Present perfect, okay. So present perfect is an action that started in the past and continues to the present. Uh, Jenny, how long have you been married? Uh, I have 15 years. I have been married. Well, Say again, please. I have. I have. Been. Mm -hmm. 15 years. I have been married. I have been married for, for 15, 15 years. years. For 15 years. Wow. 15 years. Yeah. So, Beida, how long have you worked in Cinemark? I have worked. For five years. So, Beda, what is your competition, the Cinemark? Cinepolis. Siempre existe Cinepolis. Yes. Oh. And... But Cinemark is more popular, no? Mm. Yes, it's more luxurious, maybe. Classier. Classier. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> I think that, but uh, um, the people, the un poquito de personas prefiere Cinepolis y Cinemark lo prefieren por las palomitas. Oh, really? <laughs> yes. Yeah, no voy al cine. Vaya, teacher. No, I download the movies. Morbius, maybe? Doctor Strange? Nah, ya no voy. Igual ya estoy casado. Iba <laughs> cuando era mi novia. Llega a su esposa. No la puedes oh. llevar, Qué malo. <laughs> Me tocó ver Sex in the City, man. 
Imagínense el sacrificio que hacemos los hombres por ustedes. Sí, mujeres. la quería, Beatriz. Ajá. Empezamos a salir y no sé qué Sex and the City 2, 3. Ah, no sé, pero era el último. Oh my God, what a stupid movie. Y yo, ah, qué bonito. Estoy como, oh my God, oh my God, oh my. Y en su mente, ya nos vamos a casar. Ajá, yo como, oh my God. Ya no lo voy a traer. Hasta la iglesia iba con ella. ¿Y ahora? No. Ni al súper de. No, um, encontré un método mejor. Porque ustedes mujeres. De verdad, no sé qué es la pila de las mujeres. ¿Por qué les gusta que nosotros vayamos a ver las comprar ropa? Porque siempre nos dicen, mira, estos zapatos te gustan. ¿Really? No. O sea, nos da igual, de verdad. En general, nos da igual. Y pff, igual, nunca vienen los, eh, no, pero no, prefiero aquellos. Sí. ¿Por qué preguntan? Y si no vamos... ¿Por qué no te vas a ir conmigo? Ok, entonces se me ocurrió algo. Ok, <risa> vamos a Frowned. <risa> y un día la llevé a Frowned por una hora. <risa> Mira, esta tuerca, ¿cuál crees que es mejor? ¿La cuarta o la de una pulgada? <risa> la de la puerta. Oh, man. Solución, nunca más. Y hey, esto a mí me gusta porque no te vas a ir conmigo. Solución. Oh. Qué malo, teacher. No todas somos modo, teacher. No, teacher, no todas somos iguales. No, no, hablando en general. No, pero ya. No, pero con mi esposa nos gusta hacer cosas. Nos gusta echarnos la cerveza juntos. Ya, yeah, los dos siempre salimos, vamos a un bar o algo y nos echamos cervezas. Es cool. Salucita. Aún prefiero estar con mi esposa que con mis amigos. Vamos a ver. Es bueno. Bandas tocar y. Yeah. Okay, so I have been married 10 years. 10 years. I have been I have lived in Colonia Vista Hermosa 5 years. I have been a teacher 20 years. So, the thing is, ¿creen que Jenny puede decir, no, vamos a ver, Catherine, no, Sobeida, cinco años en, cinco años en, en Cinemark, yes? Yes. And before Cinemark? Before Cinemark, I work in, la cooperativa de TCS. ¿TCS? Sí. Ah, oh, ok. Ah, tu, 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 tu. Do you I know, work... do you know Roberto Carlos Acosta? Yes. Yes. Yes, I know. Ok. But only, solo verlo sería only see. I only see him, yeah. Only see him. Okay. Um, ¿Puede usted decir yo he trabajado en TCS 10 años? Um, no. I work it. No, pero, pero usted no puede decir eso ahorita. Porque ah. ya no trabaja ahí. Okay. Entonces ahí sería simple pass. I worked. I worked. En TCS. In TCS for five years. Okay, good. I worked in TCS for five years. And now I have worked in Cinemark for five years. Okay. Okay, so that is, uh, Ana, how long have you worked in Ciudad, demo. Ciudad Mujer? No, Ciudad no, Mujer. No, it's Demo. It's, it's Demo. demo. I have worked uh, in Etemu for 15 years. 15? Yes. Wow, that's, that's good. 
Catherine, how, you live in Sansonate, yes? No, teacher. Arsa Siri? Oh, yeah. Uh, you have a boyfriend, correct? Yes, teacher. How long have you been? Been is estado. Okay. Mm -hmm. Been. Okay. Mm -hmm. How long have you been with your boyfriend? Um, I have been my boyfriend. With my boyfriend. With my bo my boyfriend. Um, for years. Four years. Yes. Wow. Next year you get married. Al rato. <laughs> <laughs> Good for you. And your boyfriend lives in Ciudad Arce? Yes. Oh, okay. Good. Okay. So do you understand I have? Yes. Yes. Ahora, hay, hay una cosa. Si, yo dice, si uno digo, dice, I have a car. It's different. Ahí estamos dando have as possession. Mm -hmm. mm. But if you see here, I have been, I have lived, I have worked, those are verbs. Okay. So verbs are not possession. Teacher. Yes. Um, excuse me. Um, siempre se, el verbo va en pasado. Participio, yes. Uh -huh. En pasado participio. Always. Okay. Always. So, por si alguien dice, bueno, I have que no es tener, yo tengo un hijo, I have a son. Yes. Mm -hmm. Si no usamos verbos. Si usamos verbo, ya es tiempo. I have lived, I have been. Solo te acordas. Okay. Okay, teacher. Oh, now I open. There's my day. There's Adele. Karen. Tum, 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 tum. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me open the platform. Okay, it says, oh yeah. <laughs> Is that a baby, Anna? <laughs> yes, teacher. <laughs> but you, your daughter is 18, no? Yes. Oh, okay. Eight. Uh, eight. Yes. Oh, she's eight. Eight. Oh, okay. I remember. I thought you said 18. No. Yo recuerdo que me dijo 18 porque yo recuerdo que le dije, wow, no parece que tiene una hija de 18. Remember, uh, class? No. Ocho. Remember, yeah, usted había dicho 18. Yo me quedé, what? Eight. No. Le dije eight years. Quizá por eso lo escucho así. Oh, maybe. Mm -hmm. Ah, ahí está una, una pregunta. Que cuando nosotros decimos I am, ¿qué sigue? An adjective. Verb? Adjective. Uh -huh. oh, okay. mm -hmm. Like I am happy. I am married. I am divorced. I am sad. Remember? Porque para decir la edad uno dice, I am 20, I am 25. 
In Spanish, we say I have. Uh -huh. But in English, why I am? Because it's the characteristic. So, Beda, how old are you? I am 28 years. Finish? Years. Old. Years old. Ahí está el adjective. Mm. Okay. That's why. I am 28 years old. Eight. Oh, okay. Se va a oír feo, pero literalmente usted dijo, tengo 28 años de vieja. Así se dice en inglés. Imagine, ugly, huh? Mm, ya no lo respondería así. <laughs> but, no, pero eso gente dice, I am 28. I am 28. Because it's not necessary, it's not necessary to finish, to finish the um, sentence. Uh, but okay. really, the... No le va a decir old, pero se me pidió que completara. Uh -huh. <laughs> but remember, when you say I am, you have to say an adjective, right? So if you analyze, I am 28 years old. Se dice I am y no I have because old is an adjective. It's not a verb. So, mejor digan, I'm 28. <laughs> so, Ana Maria, so your daughter, she's eight. Eight. Mm -hmm. All right, so, en esta clase los participantes aprenderán nuevo vocabulario relacionado con geografía. The biggest and the best. Repeat it as many times as needed. Are you ready to learn new words? Listen first and then repeat each word. Beach, desert, forest, hill, island, lake, mountain, ocean, river, valley, volcano, waterfall. Okay, we understand beach, correct? Do you, yes. you understand beach? Yes, everybody we know beach. Yes, my favorite beach in El Salvador maybe is Espino Beach. It's beautiful. Do you know what is forest? Yes. What is forest? What? Hmm? Yes, a bosque, forest. What is a hill, Sobeda? I don't know, teacher. Eh, el teleférico es en the San Jacinto Hill. Mm, cerro. Cerro. Pero igual, yo quedo igual. Si usted me preguntan qué es la diferencia de un cerro y una montaña, I don't know. Un cerro y una montaña. Teacher, Adelie, what is the difference? I don't know. Oh, no. <laughs> for, preschool, for preschoolers, I don't know what's the difference. Yeah. Maybe it's the, the a size. Volcano. Yeah, a volcano, yeah, because the volcano explodes. But <laughs> a mountain and a hill, I will never understand the difference. Yeah, maybe the size, oh, but yeah. the San Jacinto Hill is big. Yeah, it's big. Yeah. It's big. Okay, next we have an island. Valori. Isla. We have lake. Do you understand lake? Lago. Yes. Lake is um, a pool. Lago. Yes. Guatepeque. Mountain, ocean, El Salvador only has Pacific Ocean. River, do you understand river? 
the Rio, the bus. Rio. What is a valley? No. Valle. 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 Mm -hmm. Volcano. Volcan. Volcan. Very good. Salco. <laughs> no, but you know, I think the most beautiful volcano in El Salvador is Chaparrastique. Mm. It's beautiful. It's a perfect volcano. It's, it's a perfect triangle. When, when, when you go to San, when you go to, um, when you're driving and when you go to San Miguel and then you see the volcano, it's beautiful. Oh, wow. Next we have waterfall. Cascada. Cascada. Okay, so remember this because we will see why later. Hi guys, in the conversation we're about to listen to, the speakers use comparative adjectives. Do you remember how to compare? Stay around for the explanation. It is important to practice and understand the conversation. Listen and practice. Here's a geography quiz in the paper. Oh, I love geography. Ask me the questions. Sure, first question. Which country is larger, China or Canada? I know. Canada is larger than China. Okay, next. What's the longest river in the Americas? Hmm, I think it's the Mississippi. Here's a hard one. Which country is more crowded, Monaco or Singapore? I'm not sure. I think Monaco is more crowded. Okay, one more. Which South American capital city is the highest? La Paz, Quito, or Bogota? Oh, that's easy. Bogota is the highest. Hi, guys. In the conversation... Okay, let me explain something to you. This is very interesting. Look. Areli. Here I am. Areli, your name, Areli, how many consonants? Just three. Okay, good. Just three, let me see. Areli, three. Maritza, how many consonants? Okay. Um... Four. Can you tell me the four consonants? Give me uh, five consonants. Five consonants. It's simple. Look, Marita, three. Um, Just clap. If you don't know, clap. Maritza, three. Okay, okay. I'm sorry, there are not consonants. There are syllables. I'm sorry. Syllables. Oh, my yeah. God. Maritza, Four I consonants. am so sorry. I am so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> syllables. <laughs> syllables, thank you. Okay. Uh, three syllables. He, Arely. Ah, bueno, sí. Aún me lo dijo bien. <laughs> Consonants. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry. Syllables. Maritza, so how many syllables in your name? Um, have uh, three syllables. Yes, very good. Ana, M two syllables, consonant. right? And for consonants, yeah. 
Yeah. Ana, how many two. syllables? Two. Two. Ana. Two. Okay. Two. This is very important because do you understand what tall is? Do you understand tall? Alto, de altura. <laughs> Good. Y in Spanish, we say, okay, in Spanish, we say, oh man. More tall. More tall, correct? Más alto. So for example, Jenny, who is more tall, you or your husband? Eh, what say, ninguno de los dos. No, pero uno de los dos tiene que ser más alto. My husband. My husband is more tall. My husband is more tall. Good, pero in English, that's not correct. In English, we don't say more. In English, we don't say more. Than. We say taller. Taller than. Taller than. I guess I look at boy. Tall is an adjective, yes? Listen, adjectives with one, one or two one or who know those? Yes, one or two syllables. Er. Si el adjective tiene una o dos sílabas, termina en er. Tall, taller. Ugly. Ugly. -er. Thank you. Ugly er. Porque ugly, two syllables. So Catherine, what is what is the comparative of What are you listening to, Catherine? See teacher? What music is that? Um Melendi. Who? Melendi. Yes. Is that a woman or a man? Uh, Ma'am. It's a man? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Listen, what is the comparative of old? Old. Older. Very good, older. Arely, young. Younger. Good, Karen, cold, cold. My day, what is the comparative of cold? Oh, sorry, Karen. Yes, sir. Uh, I am colder. Colder. So, Eso se llaman comparatives, because we compare. Oh, I'm going to see. Hello. Uh, me cae mal cuando toca en mi teclado. Y le cambian la configuración de Spanish to English. Okay, who is taller? 
Your mother or your father? My father. Okay. So. So listen, who is taller, your mother or your father? My father is taller than my mother. Do you understand? You're comparing to your father and your mother. And you're comparing with the adjective tall. So normally in Spanish, we say, who is more tall? Your father or your mother. In English, no. We say taller. ¿Por qué, teacher? Because if the adjective is one or two syllables, decimos er. Okay? Okay. So, Beida, do you understand? Yes, teacher. Maritza, no, let me see. Maide. Maide, how old are you? Um, uh, two, three, they're old. Okay, so who is younger, you or Sobeda? Uh, no, mm, no sé cuál es la edad de... Oh, class, do you remember? Lo dijo hace poco. Sí, es que estoy trabajando también. <laughs> How old are you, Soleida? I am 28 years old. Okay. I am Dan O with Soleida. Okay, Soleida. Repeat, please. I am Dan. I am old. Dan. Mm. No es old. <laughs> Vieja. <laughs> no, pero no, en mi adjetivo era, who is younger, you or Soleida? Okay. Uh, Soleida is younger than me. Exactly. Okay. Very good. Okay. Now, ya entendíamos cuando va a er? Yes. yes, teacher. ¿Cuándo va er? One or two syllables. Very good. One or two syllables. Now, now, if the syllable is three, I'm sorry, if the adjective is three or more syllables, ya no usamos er, we say more. Example, intelligent. How many syllables? Four syllables. Four syllables. Four syllables. So that is a considerado a long syllable. So here we don't say intelligenter. We say more intelligent. Okay. No, okay, maybe, I don't know. Yes, teacher, yes. Okay, so, oh. no hay muchas con cuatro y creo que en mi vida quizás he conocido unas dos que llevan cinco o más, porque la mayoría son de tres. Pero, three syllables para arriba son considerados 
long adjectives. So, Sobeida. Oh no, Karen, I will ask Karen now. Karen, are you there? Hi. Yes. Karen, beautiful. How many syllables? Um, four syllables. Four. Vamos a ver. Beautiful. Three. Oh. Okay. Three. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So. So Karen, look, who is more beautiful? So I put it difficult, okay? Brad Pitt or me? Take your time. Take your time, it's difficult. Ni creo que está viendo Karen. Maritza, who is more beautiful, Brad Pitt or Johnny Depp for you? Uh, for me, it's uh, more beautiful, um, Brad Pitt. Okay, so. Okay. Um, uh, All right. As he said, Aponde. Brad Pitt oh, is more beautiful than, than Johnny Depp. More beautiful than. Okay, good. Catherine, who is more intelligent? You or your boyfriend? <laughs> yeah. David is more intelligent than boyfriend. <laughs> Thank <Sorry>. you. <laughs> Thank you. But my question is, who is more intelligent, you or your boyfriend? Ah, <laughs> sorry. But oh, thank uh, you. No. Thank you anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Me, teacher. Of course. I, I am. More, I am is more intelligent than boyfriend. <laughs> Good. Pero se acuerda que con I el auxiliar es am. I am. I am. Okay. This is for he and she. Okay. Good. I am okay. more intelligent than my boyfriend. Very good. Um. Okay. So listen, class. These are called comparatives. When we compare, we use adjectives. Y solo hay dos reglas. Short adjective or long adjective? What is the difference? What is a short adjective? One or two syllables. Two one or two, two syllables. syllables. No, one or two. One or two. And if it's a short adjective, we say er. If it's a long adjective, three or more syllables, and we say more. More. Ahora, cosa número dos, logic. Esto sí es cuestión de lógica, ¿ok? Por favor, sean coherentes a la hora de, de comparar cosas. Se los prometo, yo he oído casos. No vayan a decir qué es más caro, un truck tricks o una casa. <laughs> Really? That, really? Yes, teacher. What is more expensive? Oh, my God. A house. You know, no digan, ¿quién es más alto? ¿Usted o el chaparrastique volcán? Porque 
Grammaticalmente, yes, is correct. But logically, no. Por eso se llama compare. Because there's a sim similarity. Por ejemplo, no creo que podrían decir dónde hace más frío, en San Miguel o en San Salvador. Like. Para empezar, no creo que hace frío en San Miguel. Apenas hacen unos lugares en San Salvador. You know, so co coherent. <laughs> yes. For example, Sobeida. Expensive. Is it a short adjective or long adjective? Expensive. It's long adjective. Okay, entonces dígame, ¿qué es más caro? Eh, Cinemark o... ¿Cuál es el otro? Cinépolis. Who is more expensive? Cinemark or Cinépolis? Good. I don't know. Maybe, maybe Cinemark is more expensive than Cinepolis? Yes, I think. Okay, good. Same. Now, very, very good question, Sobeida. One little problem. What? Cinemark and Cinepolis are not people. So who, who is only for people? So in this case, you say which. Which? No puedo escribir. Yeah. Which is more? Which is more expensive? Okay. Okay. Which lo utilizamos para cosas. Uh huh. Okay. Who is only for people? Yeah. Oh. Y, y hoy en día diría animales porque hay mucha gente que se ofende que. Oh my God, but animals are people too. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, okay. So. Okay. You know, la generación cristal. Okay. Yes. Sí, porque antes podía decir which dog is more beautiful, el Labrador or the pit bull. Y antes se puede decir cuál perro, which dog, pero hoy hay que decir who, porque dogs are people. Okay. Yeah, you know, millenniums. Okay, so very good question, Sobeida. Uh, which is more expensive, Cinepolis or Cinemark? Very, very good. Let me see. Jenny. Tell me. Pregúntame cuál está más, no. ¿Cuál es más barato? ¿Pollo campero o Don Pollo? Okay. We Ahí see... sí se puede comparar, ¿verdad? Porque es, es, estamos casi en el mismo. Okay. But, uh, which is... Uh... El adjetivo para barato es, lo voy a escribir, look. Okay. Cheap. 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 Which is cheap? Pollo campero. Wait, wait. Ah, okay. Which is more cheap? More cheap? I don't know. Cae en la regla uno o en la dos. Okay, wait. In a one. In a one. Yes. Uh -huh. Ah, which is is cheaper? Cheaper. Cheaper. Which is cheaper? 
Pollo Campero or Don Pollo. Exactly. Very good. Can you repeat, please? Okay. Which is cheaper, Don Pollo Campero or Don Pollo? Very good. Okay. Marie, my day. Yes, teacher. Do you drink liquor? What? Do you drink liquor? Not teacher. I I don't drink liquor. Beer? Not teacher. I don't drink beer. beer. Good for you. Thank you. Le iba a preguntar cuál es más fuerte, tequila o vodka. <laughs> okay. Uh, strong. Strong uh -huh. is the fuerte. Which is stronger, tequila or vodka? Okay, but let me see, let me see, let me see. ¿Cómo se dice saludables? Healthy. Healthy. Okay, my dear, pregúnteme. ¿Cuáles son más saludables? saludables? ¿Pupusas de arroz o pupusas de maíz? We, uh, Which pupusas? Which is, como dijeron que era saludable? Healthy. With healthy. With more healthy pupusas. There. Rice pupusas o corn pupusas? ¿Cómo fue? Ok, ra, rice pupusas o uh, corn pupusas. Rice pupusas o corn pupusas. Ok, can you repeat the question, please? With, with more. Ay, se me olvida la palabra. Healthy. Healthy, with, with more healthy rice pupusa o corn pupusa. Okay. Anna, is that correct? I think it's healthier. Good. Healthier. My day. Healthy is two <laughs> syllables. Look. Healthy. Two syllables. So it's a short syllable. So it's healthier. Do you understand, my dear? It's time, microphone. Oh, but you're working. No, no, teacher, no, this are complete. Okay. ¿Por qué es healthier, Catherine? Um, healthy and um, two syllables. Healthy. No, no escuchó cuando hicimos las reglas de los adjetivos, my dear. Eh, sí, pero... Más o menos. Yeah. No, es que entiendo porque estaba trabajando, right? Sí. Yeah, so. Okay, but es solo una regla que si es one or two syllables, le ponemos er. Ajá. Uh -huh. Al final. Ah, okay. Okay. Thank you. Uh -huh. Maritza, hi. Uh -huh. Hi, teacher. Hello. 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 Pregúnteme a dónde hace, a dónde es más frío. En, en Rusia o en Canadá. Ok, ok. Uh, which is colder um, Russian? Or Canada. 
Good. I think Russia is colder than Canada. Oh, really? Yes. I think uh, um, Canada. Pensé que Canada. Uh -huh. No, creo que incluso creo que el lugar más frío del mundo está en Rusia. Oh, no sé. No lo que, sabía. Pensé que Canadá era el lugar más frío. No, it's Russia. Okay. Because Russia is big. <laughs> Cierta parte de Rusia, creo. Ok, eh, vamos a continuar con esto mañana. Recuerden las reglas. Oh, man, eso, si ustedes se acuerdan de estas reglas, no van a tener problema. Okay, Porque teacher. es bien fácil, solo okay. son dos reglas. Yes. Porque en español, en español es más fácil porque siempre es more. ¿Cuál es más caro, más alto, más feo? Más, más, más. Por eso se van, les va a costar adaptarse a eso porque siempre van a decir more. More. Incluso a veces van a decir more taller. Uh, yes, but it's practice. Okay, okay then teacher. goodbye. I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you. Bye, Bye teacher. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Bye.